Environmentalists have been warning for long that the poor will have to bear the brunt of environmental degradation the most. Communities living in utmost harmony with nature may end up suffering the wrath of climate change the most. All of this seems to be coming true in the Indian state of Assam, where recent floods have devastated lives and livelihoods of millions of people. Our next report telling you more. Floods in the Indian state of Assam has left all these fields submerged. Livelihoods too of millions of farmers has also been submerged. Recent floods in the northeastern state have inundated thousands of hectares of cultivated lands. Many of these fields had standing crops ready to be harvested. Now months of hard work is lost. The pain for these people doesn't end here. Flood waters also washed away their cattle, hens and fishes. Farm animals help these communities sustain their livelihoods in between cropping seasons. They also provide an alternate source of income during exigencies brought by low crop yield, drought and other unforeseen situations. With many farmers losing them as well, life after the flood is also going to be tough. All the houses here have been damaged by floods. Our wheat, rice, hens, cows, everything has drowned. The farmlands have drowned too. The floods took away the fish from the fisheries. We are breaking ourselves every day and going through extreme difficulties to get food. The government is not providing us much relief. There are no proper roads left. We are in pain. State government data shows floods, inundation and rain-induced landslides have killed at least 179 people in the state so far. More than 40,000 hectares of land was left inundated. Over 7 million people were displaced. Most of them now compelled to take refuge in relief shelters and roadside tents. They are now at the mercy of government aid for food and other essential supplies. The flood water is expected to recede soon, but that may leave further problems for the local population. Cases of fever and skin diseases are rising in relief shelters. Experts fear unhygienic surroundings left by receding water will lead to further increase in spread of diseases. Bureau Report, We On, Wild is One. We On, now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.